Hey guys, today I am back with another video and today I am making dung kofta. It's uh, simple, it's easy and it's not that much time consuming. So for that I need 3 pounds of no fat kofta and I have my 3 potatoes. It's this size, not too small, not too big. I won't call it medium and two medium sized onions um, four of hot chili peppers and ginger garlic paste my salt homemade garam masala this is coriander seeds grinded and pepper crushed let's start it Everything has been grinded. I'm just gonna put all the mixture in my meat. This is three pound, no fat, keema. It's, I'm using beef, you can use chicken, mutton, anything. And it's time to mix it. It's time to put all my spices. So I'm just gonna put my coriander powder it's half tablespoon one full of this half tablespoon same spoon i'm using for my homemade garam masala half tablespoon this is ginger garlic paste again just gonna use half tablespoon salt as per taste I'm putting just one full teaspoon of salt because it has potatoes you need a little bit more of salt again mixing time it's time to make the size of the kebab I'm just taking this this much just make it a kebab like this I'm making all of them same kebabs are made I'm just gonna fry them just fry it until it gets this dark color keep frying because I want this to be very dark brown and take it into a different pot I think I need two tomatoes, one raw onion and one potato. I'm just going to cut it like this. So for the water, I have one full cup of water. One fourth teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of turmeric, and half a teaspoon of ginger garlic paste. I'm just going to mix it together. And this water mixture is going on top of the garnish tomato potato and onion I'm just gonna leave it for them put the flame on low please don't add too much water and now it's gonna get them It's all ready. As you can see, all the vegetables are losing their juice. And potato is fully cooked. And 